here segment number two of John Flynn's birthday special, in which it's time for Jeffy for the SNES. Let's see how we do this game, shall we? We're ready. One daily double up there in one of these categories. Fruits and veggies. Flowers. Starts with the letter G. Literature. TV trivia. And finally, Missouri natives. Okay. I'm going to start things off with flowers for 100, please. The answer is... Everything's better with this state flower of Texas on it. What is the blue bonnet? I'll have uh, flowers for 200. The answer is... Tropical flower and household plant in colors from white to purple. What is the orchid? No, that's wrong. Mm. Rough start. It's the African violet. Flowers 300. The answer is. Fastest lightning symbol of floral trans world delivery found on florist's doors. Mercury. Alright. Flowers 400. The answer is. This flower, once sacred to India, China, and Egypt, shares its name with the mythical plant of daydreams. It's the lotus. Well, let's close it out. Let's get it out of the way. The answer is... The name of this flower with many ray-like petals is from the Greek for star. Oh, gosh. It's the aster. All right. I'll have uh, fruits and veggies 100. The answer is... The pickled pepper Peter might have picked for stuffing green olives. Oh, we should do all right here. What is the pimento? What are pimentos? I'll have fruits and vegetables for 200. The answer is... Often called a cross between a plum and a peach, it's actually an unfuzzy variety of peach. What is a nectarine? Fruits and vegetables for 300. The answer is. The Chinese consider it good luck to receive gifts of this tiny orange like fruit. What is a kumquat? Uh, fruits and vegetables 400. The answer is. Cultivated for its long, white, edible root, it's the pale, unpopular cousin to the carrot. What is a parsnip? Fruits and vegetables, five. The answer is. Member of the cabbage family that's an essential ingredient to essential ingredient in chicken demon. What is broccoli? All right, ran the category, worked for $1,400. I'll have literature for 100. The answer is. Napoleon's invasion of Russia was the subject of this Tolstoy epic. Uh, what is War and Peace? Literature for 200? The answer is... He gave Walter Mitty a secret life. Jim? James Thurber. Oh, that's right. I usually forget that clue once in a while. Now the trick for 300. The answer is... The Vlog of Apocalypse Now was adapted for this short Joseph Conrad novel. What is Heart of Darkness? I'll 
I'll have um, literature for four. The answer is. Imperialist author who coined the phrase the sun never sets on the British Empire. Who's Rudyard Kipling? Literature five. Daily double. All in. Ayn Rand's architect design then destroyed this title complex. What was the fountainhead? Yay! I'll have Missouri Natives 100. Yes, Branson, Missouri's annual Cupista honors, celebration honors Rose O'Neill, who created this. Uh, what is the Cupid doll? Uh, Missouri Natives for 200. Yes, a restored courtroom in Independence features a multimedia show based on his life. Who is Harry Truman? Missouri Natives 300. Carthage was home to Bell Star of the Wild West and this star of Wild Kingdom. Who's Marlon Perkins? Missouri Natives 4. The answer is. You can tour the home near Kearney where he was born in the house in St. Joseph where he was shot. Who's Jesse James? Missouri Natives 5. The answer is. The second most famous resident of Hannibal, she survived a shipwreck and inspired a musical. Who's Molly Brown? This blessing can be said either before or after a meal. What is grace? Starts with G2. The answer is. A notable exploit, whether or not it's performed by a man named Bo. What is a jest? G3? The answer is. It's the last short name of John Robert, the Irishman known for his hand. Jenny. Greg. Oh, okay. Got it. So it's G4. The answer is. From the word for hunted meat, it can mean off color or off flavor. What is gamey? Start G5. The answer is. Stano, Uriel, and Medusa. Who are the Gorgons? That just leaves TV trivia. 100. The answer is... Nickname of Chuck Connors' character, Lucas McCain. And I got locked out. The Rifleman. The answer is... He played the band of Freddie Prinze's Chico. Jim. Jack Albertson. Oh, yeah, that's right. The answer is... Subject taught by Armis Brooks. What is English? Four hundred. The answer is. Knighted by 
by the Queen. This PBS host can't be called Sir because he's a U.S. citizen. Jenny? Alistair Cook. That last clue. The answer is... The pilot for this PBS serial was the vintage years. Jim. Falcon Crest. So at the end of the Jeopardy round, I have $7,400. Jim has $1,000. Jenny has $700. So she's going first. Dollar values will be doubled. We're going to put two daily doubles up on the board. And, as always I mentioned, Double Jeopardy is usually the tougher round. We'll find out if the categories are going to be just as tough. Or if they sound that way. We're going to deal with Andy, in quotation marks, Business and Industry, Science, HH, Mammals, and finally, European history. These categories don't sound too bad. Jenny, you're in third place. We'll start with you. Where are we going? We're going to HH for 200. The answer is... This playboy married one of his playboy centerfolds. Who's Hugh Hefner? I'll have HH for 400, please. The billionaire in Terry Moore is the beauty and the billionaire, who is uh, Howard Hughes. H H six. The answer is. She is called the first lady of the American stage. Oh, Jenny locked me out. Too late. Helen Hayes, yeah, I knew it. Oh well. Jenny takes second place, but she still trails me by quite a margin. And a mammal's 200. The answer is. In poor life, this sense in cats can be six times sharper than man's. What is sight? I'll have HH 800. The answer is. Along with Muskie, he lost to Nixon Agnew in 68. Was Hubert Humphrey? And we'll close out HH. The answer is... Meredith's Music Man. Who's Harold Hill? There we go. Up to ten thousand dollars. Mammals four hundred. The answer is. Though class is carnivores, these black and white bears primarily eat bam bamboo shoots. Ah. Oh. Pandas. I knew that one. Now Jim is in second place, but he trails me by quite a margin. Business and industry two hundred. The answer is. This company was the first to use armored cars commercially. What is brakes? I'll have um, business and industry 400. The answer is. Millionaire hotel magnet whose autobiography was titled Be My Guest. Jenny. Conrad Hilton. All right. So teeter totter battle for second place between Jenny and Jim right now. Mammal six hundred. The answer is. Porpoises are the smallest tooth varieties of these. Up. Uh. Whales, yeah. Andy two hundred. The answer is. The black and white bear of Walter Lance cartoons. Ah, oh. I know these clues, but they're, I'm getting beat to the buzzer. Andy Panda. 
<coughs> Andy 400. One of the daily doubles, it's gonna cost me. And Jenny's going all in on this clue. Family Affair was the first of 15 films in which Mickey Rooney played this character, and it's Andy Hardy. That's $3,800, Jenny. Good job. Science 200. The answer is. The first solvent widely used by modern dry cleaners. It was unleaded. What's gasoline? I'll have uh, Andy for 600, please. The answer is. Red Smite's pub curling comic strip husband of Flo. Who's Andy Cap? Andy 800. The answer is. Donnie Osmond made his debut at the age of four on his show. Who is Andy Williams? Andy 1000. The answer is. An eight hour static film in the Empire State Building. Empire State Building was done by this pop artist, who is Andy Warhol. I'll have, um, Science 400. The answer is... It's our solar system's second largest planet. Ugh. Saturn. Oh, okay. Probably would have been wrong either way, so... Mammals 800. The answer is... One hour variety, these armored creatures can be five feet long and weigh 120 pounds. Ah! Got locked out again. Armadillos, yeah. Business and Industry 600. Waterford Crystal is from the town of Waterford in this country. Jim. Ireland. This is an industry 800. The answer is. 1984 Standard Oil of California changed its name to this. What is Exxon? That is incorrect. Jim. Chevron, okay. Science, 600. The answer is... Depending on the length of the path this takes, thunder might be a short clap or a long rumble. What is lightning? Go we'll science, 800. In the double. All the 20th century Austrian zoologist Carl von Frisch discovered the dance of these insects. What are bees? Science a thousand. The answer is. It's a special field of computer science trying to come up with machines that think for themselves. What is artificial intelligence? There we go, good for a thousand. I'll have mammals one thousand. Female rabbits mate within twelve hours after each repetition of this life cycle event was giving birth. Business and industry for a thousand. The answer is America must import ninety-six percent of its bauxite from which this metal is derived. What is aluminum? That just leaves that last category. Two. The answer is. Peter the Hermit's preaching aroused public support for the first of these expeditions in 1096. What are the Crusades? Four. 
for? The answer is... King John accepted it June 15th, 1215. What's the Magna Carta? Six. The answer is... In the 16th and 17th centuries, this royal family ruled Spain as well as Austria. Where are the Habsburgs? Eight hundred. The answer is two years after becoming Kaiser in 1888, Germany's Wilhelm II dismissed this famous chancellor, who was all of on Bismarck. Last clue. The answer is. Forces from this duchy conquered southern Italy as well as England in the 11th century. What is... what was... Duchy, uh... What was the Netherlands? No. So I'm going to finish with $29,200 in cash. See if Jim knows this. I forget this clue. Oh, he doesn't know. Jimmy. Normandy. Alright, let's play Final Jeopardy. Category is letter perfect. 800. The battle found in the names of seven of the nine planets. You. Mercury, Venus, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. It's correct. So I'm going to win John $30,000 this segment. Let's see if Jim came up with it. Yes. Did Jenny come up with it? Yes. As did I. And we will wrap it up for this segment. I'll see you all for that next one.